All right, so I'm going to show you how to set up a domain with, uh, I'm using Google Domains and Cloudflare, and then I'm going to connect Cloudflare to ClickFunnels. Super easy. So I buy my domains off of Google Domains because of G Suite, and that's my business email. It's super easy to integrate with things, as well as, you know, all the free hardware uh, that comes with it and teams and it's super easy to do and it connects with you know my blog and everything else just super easy to connect with everything okay so I'm gonna use uh, custom donate domain servers oh. okay so you're going to either create a Cloudflare account or you're going to sign up for one you're gonna sign up for the free plan so you just correct uh, free and then continue uh, I, I don't use the paid plan uh, I don't know anything about that I just use the free plan um, but so we're going to go down here. We're going to grab these name servers and this is what we're going to put into Google domains. So we're going to copy and paste. Boom. Copy and paste. So we're at Google domains. We're going to copy and paste uh, the name server. Okay, there's one. And then we're going to add another one. Which is super easy. We're going to hit save. Boom. Now we're done over there. So that was the name servers on Google domains. So we just did the custom domain name servers, copy and paste that. We don't have to do anything with this stuff. So we're going to go back over to Cloudflare. So we're going to add a C name record. Okay. And then we're going to do at, or it doesn't matter. We can do www at uh, our, our domain. So I'm going to do marketing. Uh, marketing masses com. This is just a domain name that I had forever ago. Okay. And then what did I just do? I did W. Uh, so we got to do at, and then this is gonna be target click funnels. Okay. And uh, I screwed it up already. So we got to do the C name first. So now it's gonna cancel out. Target at ClickFunnels. Target dot ClickFunnels. ClickFunnels dot com. Right, and so if you, you know, this is one of my things. But if uh, you need help with anything, if you, you know, use my link, I'm gonna do all this for you. Uh, so we're gonna check our SSL really quick. We gotta make sure. See, that's on flexible. We gotta make sure that's on full. Okay. Now we got one more thing to do. All right, that's full. Now we're going to go to our page rules. Okay, so this is our page rules. Okay, so we're going to do marketingmasses.com. Uh, don't do the www or the HTTPS, but you're going to have that little hyphen and then that little, I don't know what it's called. It's like a star thing. On mine, you know, it'd be control F or whatever. Uh, but so now we're going to forward that URL. So put the little thing and then the star, and then we got a permanent redirect, okay? And then we're going to do HTTPS. Slash okay, seven. so make sure your page rules look exactly like this. Uh, let me zoom in a little bit. All right, so make sure your page rules look exactly like this. So you're just doing this. So you're doing your domain slash then the little star. You're going to forward the URL, permanent redirect, and then uh, HTTPS, blah, blah, blah ww uh, marketing masses boom you're gonna save it and then you're good to go okay you're gonna check back at your make sure your uh, SSL is on full and make sure that your C name looks just like this okay so marketing masses so your domain then target at click funnels and then ww there's no dot Okay, so www and then at marketingmasses.com. So that's going to be your domain. So now we're going to jump over to ClickFunnels. And then so we've done all this on our side from, you know, Cloudflare. Okay, so now we're going to check the domain. And then all we need to do is verify it. So now they're checking it. It says, good job. You just did it. Marketing went great. So now we got to associate it with a funnel. So I'm going to associate that with... One of my funnels and then we're gonna all right so we associated that with one of the ofa funnels so now we just need to we're gonna have to verify it 
and then put in our settings. So now we're going to take it back to the, oh, so it's verifying now. So it's being processed. It usually takes like an hour or two. If that, it just really depends. I've had it work in like 15 minutes. So we're going to do the default page. Boom. So we associated with that. So if somebody puts in anything else wrong, it's going to go back to that first opt-in page. So you're just going to do that as well. Uh, expand your setup, your custom. Awesome. So once everything's verified, the SSL and everything. So now we just have to wait, but that's about it. So yeah, as soon as it gets processed and it's verified, we can start running traffic to that. It's as simple as that. Uh, if you need help or you know you got any questions, hit me in the email or text me.